Well, good morning and welcome to Special Offer Communities and Offers Dyke. Uh, this is not the introduction. This is a kind of prelim to a couple of introductions, one by an Anglo-Saxon king him himself and one by uh, me. Um, and this is really to give you some preliminary understanding of what's going to happen today, what it's all about. So we were having an event. It was going to happen in a village hall in Trevonan in northwest Shropshire. And we had to cancel because of COVID-19. And so we've moved digitally. So this is a, a bit of an experiment. We've got a range of different presentations happening throughout the day that will be taking place online, through Twitter, through Facebook and coming from the Office Night Collaboratory blog and from um, YouTube also, uh, as as is this, I think, or well, that's what the aim is to do. <laughs> so um, here I am at home enjoying splendid isolation of uh, an academic working from home. Um, and let me introduce you to the schedule for today. So first of all, um, there's the hashtags we're going to be using. Um, special offer and offers dyke, hashtag offers dyke. You don't have to use capital letters, but it helps to space it out easier for people to see. But hashtag special offer, hashtag offers dyke. And th these are the links through to Facebook and Twitter, but you can just Google and find us. And the offers dyke collaboratory blog will have everything. And I shall be archiving everything with a, a, a blog post that br brings all the links together afterwards. So if you miss anything for today, if you can't stay with us through the, the day itself, that doesn't matter. You'll still be able to tune in and access all of the bits and bobs going on. So this is organised by myself and Pauline Clark, a doctoral researcher at the University of Chester, and liaison with Andy Heaton of the Trevonan Rural Protection Group, TRPG. And we're really grateful to Andy for the facilitation he, and work uh, he's he's provided in getting this off the ground. We're just so frustrated we can't be there in, in person on on the actual on the actual day, um, uh, but, but we're here. We're here. We're doing something. Okay, so. Uh, uh, you know, this is this is this is better than just cancelling, eh? So, firstly, there's going to be it's me introducing. Then we've got King Redwald at uh, nine forty-five, and at ten uh, nine fifty, I'm going to launch the Office Dyke Journal Volume Two. Not the whole thing. We're going to start off by releasing one article online for that will be one of many that will appear open access, totally free to authors to publish, totally free to um, read and, and access that information of the latest and recent work on Offers Dyke and Watts Dyke and other linear monuments across the island of Britain and beyond. We're then going to move on to a series of presentations by others. Uh, Dave McGlade is chairman of the Offers Dyke Association and uh, runs the Offers Dyke Centre down in Knighton in Powys. And he's going to introduce the Offers Dyke Conservation Management Plan. He's not going to do that via video. We're going to post a blog and we are also going to tweet out the key salient points of his talk. Um, and we'll also share it on Facebook. So you, you'll have a talk at 10.15. I'll release Dave McGlade's presentation about the Offers Dyke Conservation Management Plan. Then we've got uh, the local group, uh, the Trevolan Heritage Group, who are going to present... Um, on Trevonan's heritage and Offers Dyke, and that's Kay Kimber, R.T. Emmons, Edmonds, and Chris Woods. So they're going to represent a broader group of local enthusiasts and um, interested in 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 Offers Dyke, but also the the history and archaeology of the of the area. Then we have uh, an Offers Dyke sonnet and Osristry round challenge by Dave Andrews and as with the Trevon and Heritage piece and the Dave Andrews piece they will be on the blog on the Office Night Collaboratory blog and also will post out elements on social media and back to Dave McGlade for the Office Night Path 50th anniversary and he'll be reflecting on the path as it as it comes to its 50th anniversary and the range of things that are going to be going on um, next year then we'll have a digital coffee break with E Biscuits. Um, I'm already on tea. I'm on Vikings tea, just so you know. They are the Vikings. They are a very wonderful mug. mug. Let me just have a quick mug sip of E tea. Um, e tea? Uh, anyway, digital tea. Ah, tastes so good online. And then we'll be moving on on 11.30 to 
me presenting about public archaeology and Wattsdyke. And I'll introduce you to Wattsdyke and some of the challenges we face in engaging Wattsdyke with the public and heritage interpretation. And Alan Brown will be presenting on Kai Allen, What's Going On? Uh, and then John G. Swagger will be drawing people in, comics and borderlands archaeology. And both of those papers by Alan and John will be presented as blog posts that will tweet out key elements of them um, during those time slots. And then yak about Offers Dyke. Mel uh, Roxby uh, Mackay and Ian Mackay will be presenting via Twitter presentation uh, their work with the Young Archaeologist Club. Uh, their new branch they've set up um, um, associated with Offers Dyke. So that's going to be a real exciting presentation. And then just before our hyperlinked buffet lunch, uh, the Northern Quest for Offers Dyke is presented by Ray Bailey, who has been a real uh, stalwart for of um, um, local enthusiasts and uh, heritage expert as well in many ways, um, who has been exploring the northern stretches of Offers Dyke. So he'll be presenting via a blog post that, again, I will try to tweet out some of the key salient points for his talk. Then our hyperlinked buffet lunch, and that rounds off the morning, and we move on to the afternoon. And at 2 p.m., we have the special a special offer from the PAS. What the early medieval material early medieval material culture tells us about life in the Welsh marches. Um, Peter Evil is 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 a, 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 a an archaeologist and expert on early medieval uh, small finds and prehistoric uh, artifacts too, and he is going to give us a really uh, a treat there. Uh, we follow follow that Twitter presentation from Peter with a blog post presentation by Pauline Clark, who's just started her PhD research at the University of Chester on the formation of the Anglo Welsh borderlands in the early Middle Ages, portable antiquities um, in the landscape. So that's going to be useful as well. So we've got a range of papers looking at the dikes in their broader context. And then we have exploring remotely the effects of Offers Dyke within the landscape by Liam Delaney. And we're going to have some run throughs, some exciting videos as part of his Twitter presentation. And then Digidike and Linear Earthworks Online by Chloe Bridge and myself uh, will be looking at how we use digital media in new ways to engage people with these exciting, uh, interesting, enigmatic and huge um, linear earthworks. Then we're having our online afternoon tea break with E Scones or E Scones, depending on the way you say it. And then we're back for the final um, presentations. We have three back to back presentations by Julian Ravist, who has been doing a lot of drone work along Offers Dyke. So he's looking at Pen Offer and then um, uh, uh, discovering an enclosure next to Offers Dyke, um, just south of Knighton, and then a possible Roman signal station under Offers Dyke. Um, he presents about before we get to uh, 4.30 where we have our special offer tragical history tour, a virtual tour by myself around Trevonan, showing you some of the uh, offers Dyke in the flesh and, and, and introducing you to the monument and its landscape context. So I, I hope you join me for that, where I, I did wear a silly jacket and hat. I, I, God knows why, but it seemed like a good idea at the time. So that's going to happen at 4.30, and that'll be YouTube, Twitter, Facebook. It'll all be out there, OK? and then. Perhaps, perhaps the highlight, at least it's a highlight for me, uh, at 6pm we have on YouTube, um, or linked through YouTube, I'm not sure exactly how he does it by the magic of technology, Archeo Soup himself is here, um, and he is going to interview me about the special offer, offer event, and we're going to have a special offer Archeo Soup live event to wrap up the day. So that's what's going to happen. I hope you stay with us for the whole of the day. If not, you can catch up with everything later on. Um, I've been Howard Williams and I will be Howard Williams in, as I reappear in, in dangerous numbers of manifestations and uh, T-shirts uh, throughout the day. And uh, if you want to get in touch, I, I'm, I'm at howard.williams at Chester ACUK. I am on uh, the Office Dyke uh, Collaboratory um, website. I'm also on Twitter um, as Archeodeath. You can uh, contact me 
and I hope you engage, retweet, ask questions and at any point through the day. If you've got any other questions about the presentations, you want to find out more, um, get in touch via Twitter or Facebook and I can put you in direction of other people or key resources. And hopefully this isn't simply about a series of presentations. The whole day will gel together and inspire, hopefully, some of you to get involved, get interested, learn more about Offers Dyke. And hopefully we'll be promoting the Offers Dyke journal, which is sitting on the shelf behind me over here. Um, um, and you can see um, it on, on uh that side. Yes, there it, there it is. The Office Night Journal, which volume one came out last year and volume two is coming soon. And so hopefully um, that will be a place you can learn more about Office Dyke, Watts Dyke and other linear monuments. Thank you very much. See you soon for a full introduction in a little while.